Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Workers and Resources, Soviet Republic, the People's Proletarian Petroleum Prefecture, number 225. The new town, the latest edition. I mean, it's not ready yet, but goddammit, I can't wait any longer. We're bringing in people in now. We said this allows citizens to move into this building. See if we get anything. Yeah, one person, two people have gotten in here. Yes, so they're, they're starting to, to move in. Good. Good for them. And uh, hopefully we get enough people here that, that they can man the various... Uh, the various establishments and also go to, to, to the bus stop. Because that would really be of benefit to us here if we can have a local supply of workers. Yeah, so we'll allow this some time to do stuff. And then we have the train distribution office, huh? which is without power supply for some reason. Okay, crap. That's unfortunate, uh, but we can fix. We have helicopters, you can build that. Apparently they have done all but the substation, it would appear. Yes, train distribution office without fuel. I don't know if we dare send it them out then yes we do we have a uh, train diesel stations do we not yeah yeah, yeah we do uh, because you have um, I managed to, to get the railroad into the mechanical components uh, factory warehouse so eventually when this is, is finished it's actually working on it quite uh, quite rapidly We'll be able to get the mechanical components out of there and steel we already have on the railroad. Uh, it's just a matter of finding it. It's, it's next to the steel mill and that's here. Uh, here. Here it is. There. Uh, load steel. I didn't manage to finish entirely. Can't find path to, to garage or garage or building. Okay. Uh, right, and then the question is: Do we use this for uh, for bitumen uh, transport too, or do we use a dedicated train for, for for that? I don't know. We could try using the train distribution office for it. It might be dangerous. Load bitumen. Uh, load steel, load bitumen, sure, uh, load anything else. Yeah, mechanical components once we have those, but we don't have them just yet. And here is where you unload the bitumen. Unload bitumen. More than 30%, 70% say. Did anything happen? Building is without power supply. What? Ah, oh, it's yet another substation here that, that has not been actually built. Hmm. Again, unfortunate. However, workers here, how are you doing? You can't participate in any sport, you can't get electronics, you can't enjoy culture, you can't get meat, you can't get food. Why not? No one of you, you have to work at the shopping center too, you know. You can't just be standing around outside. If you were to work at the shopping center, you, all of this, these issues would... Uh, would sort of resolve themselves. Uh, so I think I've seen this before when you only have one building. It doesn't matter how many people actually live in it. It's, a, it's something with the timing maybe of one building. Or perhaps or nothing. Now we have 
The shop is all right. Uh, we should get a meat truck for them. Refrigeration truck. Refrigeration. Oh, we take this one. Uh, that was not a crash. That was an auto save. Thank you. Load. Unload. Wait. Get going. But the, the train distribution office, did you send anything at all? Ah. I don't think you did. I suppose you need power or something to, to do that, then to operate. Because they, these places, this this one, this has uh, power, you know. So you'd be, you should be able to send uh, steel here. Uh, you'll have power without, within um, mere moments. Now again, lots of people standing around outside the shop. Yeah, you're going to have to figure this out a little bit better. For this to, in order for this to work. We do have people working there. We no workers at the kindergarten. But how, how many are we so far? We're, we are... No one lives here. Um, but they're allowed to move in. No one wants to move in. So far. Ah, this is the new frontier. Come on. It's going to be fantastic down here eventually. You want to live here? And do we get workers any at any point waiting at the bus platform so that we can have the local construction office actually bring workers to, to a construction site or two? Ah, not really, no. They uh, seem to be elsewhere occupied. We could force people to move in here. Relocate them, that is. Ah. Oh, no, we're not in a rush to get... ...to get this up and running. Although it is a bit problematic that they have that many problems. Yes, they do right now. Yes. This. But such is it in the Soviet Republic sometimes. Can't... Can't do much about it. Uh, you see, we have three of the electrical components factories are done. Um, this is, uh, is anyone working on that? No, not really, no. The plastics factory is... Uh, 500 workdays remaining, and you have two cranes to help you have all the resources. Ooh. Very nice. And how about this, uh, this little road here out to my train diesel station? How's that coming along? I should be coming along. It's just that it requires quite a bit of gravel. And these pedestrian underpasses and things, are they done to such an extent that we can see how far they will get? You have... no. This one just got the boards to and one worker. Who won't be able to do anything. Steel? And you also need 32 tons of bricks. Hmm. 
Now you have 32 tons of bricks and 4.4 tons of steel, but no boards. A wood plastics factory is done. Missing chemicals and oil. Uh, yes, oil. Um, petroleum. That's supposed to go in here. I don't think I'm going to use the, the train distribution office for that. I'm going to do, do a classic train from, from, from point A to point B. Uh, mm, 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 mm. Rail, road, depot, rail, depot. Oh, we have. Look at this. 2,400 tons. That's a bit much. See if we can get rid of a few of these wagons. This might be a bit more manageable by the railroad. Uh, 1,320 tons. Sure. Great. Uh, clear, clear your schedule. And now, to load petroleum, if you're a train, uh, you'd want to... You could go in here, maybe. You could also go in here, although you're going to have a problem if there's a boat. But I think that you'll take priority over the boat. So, there then. Yes, load, wait. And uh, around here is where we want to go with this train. Somewhere. Yes, uh, out here. There. Wait until unloaded. And uh, get going. Yeah, this does. Do a bit of refueling. That's probably wise. Is the power plant the power plant actually running nowadays? Pretty decent. 50, 55 megawatts. I need to see the train actually doing its thing, uh, actually getting loaded, and uh, if it takes priority over the ship. I'm pretty confident that it will, but uh, I'm going to confirm this, that it actually does. There we go. Yes, it does. And therefore it gets the... Uh, uh, the overflow, which is not processed in 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 oil refineries. Okay, that's good. You're done. Good. Uh, do you work now? You have fuel. You have uh, you have work to do. Have you sent any bitumen or something? Have you sent the train? Not really. Oh, okay. Maybe it can't work with uh, with oil unloading things. Oh, what good is it then? Not a whole lot. 
Um, but yes, we, we go there and there we unload a bit of steel. That worked. That got it going. That means that we're going to have to do a traditional setup for for the oil, I suppose. Or for the bitumen, rather. Yes, we need... We can use the, the other train that was in the depot. Maybe. I'm sort of looking at the depot, more or less. It's... Um, that's a television station, radio station, train distribution office, train depot. Capacity a thousand and eighty tons. Oh, we have a long tracks, so we can use long trains. Why are you so uh, afraid of using long trains all of a sudden? Uh, don't know, don't be, it'll be fine. Uh, now, let's see, whilst we're around here, the 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 railroad towards the mechanical components ought to be finished and if we can find a list of buildings, uh, train distribution office on all of the map and the one in Bongni I believe is the one. Uh, uh, you, you go um, it's somewhere around here. Here, here's where you go. There you load uh, mechanical components, nothing else, please. And you unload those at. Do you know where to unload those? Not really. Okay. Police not arrived. Uh, okay. Yes, we're going to fix that too. Uh, the one thing at a time now, please. Should should we slow it down? <laughs> oh. Keep it at full speed. Uh, the, the, the bitumen, we want to load bitumen. That is uh, down here. I can't see anything in the rain, but uh, I sort of don't know where it is. I think it is in this one. Yes, it is in this one that we have bitumen. You go there, you wait until you're fully loaded on bitumen. And then you go sort of by here, closest to it. The Bungni train distribution office, no, you're not set up to unload at, at the warehouse just yet. But there you go, now you're set up to unload mechanical components at the warehouse. Very good, but we remove this connection because that doesn't seem to work. Oh, so never mind. Let me do that the old fashioned way by doing this. Oops. By doing this. Uh, yes. These are not quite finished just yet. How how yes, police. Police we need we need a bit of police. We have police officers and staff, they they just don't have any any vehicles. There you go. Now we have vehicles, now we can go out on patrol. Ten workers can't work because there is no kindergarten, but there is. Huh. Hmm. Okay, this seems pretty decent. So do we even have work? No, workers waiting at the bus stop. One student waiting. Should we set up the line then for students? Uh, line. List of line. A new line. Yes. What was the town, town name again? 
Svennemannen. Svenne... Mannen studenter. Yes. You go from the student end station. Uh, to, to the student that's workers. Uh, so the other one. This one. Load. And then you have a little bit of a travel ahead of you. Uh, around here is, is where you go. This is the stop, stop right there. Unload. That's what you do. And... Um, Bogny Road Vehicles Depot. Yes. Get like a pretty, pretty significant amount of buses to this line. That many to begin with. And you're loading up on the bitumen. Very good. You're almost full. You're full now. And now you head off to get down here. Also very good. Okay, this this town is starting to, to take shape, maybe. Something is starting to happen with it. Uh, still quite a lot of work to do here. Uh, yes. Why aren't there any workers waiting at the bus stop? We have 625 in this building and 426 in this one. That should be enough to, to actually you know, have a little bit of uh, workers that do not find work anywhere else but, but go to the bus stop to work. In my opinion, unless we sink them into something around here, but I don't think so. No, well, why? Uh... Could it be like a construction project or something that they're going to? Ah, that's where it is. That is what it is. I see. Like all of them are, are going to, to try and build more buildings here. Yes, but there is no material quite yet. So you'll have to w wait a bit with this. Oops, you can't just stop. Oh, here you go. Epidemic situation report, and it was a real bad one, it seems like. Uh, impacted serious infection, yes. Seasonal event according to our uh, expert, this infection should disappear soon. Okay, now we got 200 workers waiting at the bus stop. Much better. And uh, did you spring into life then and, uh, and start using them? Maybe. Like this bit, for example. We've been waiting for a long time for someone to come and do this road. Yeah, and there you have it. Yeah, they, are, they are coming. Good. Construction is already complete. Construction is already complete. Road connection with the thing doesn't exist. No. Have I... Uh, Oops. It seems that in my... Oh. Yes, but we can get the road through here. So no problem, no problem, no problem, no problem, no worries. And of course 
course we do at least a gravel road. Uh, And for this then we take um, we take the local construction office. Uh, wait for 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 what for the road? We need to, to build the road first, you know. And they already picked up on it. They picked up on that too. Then we, it might now be time for, to tell the truth here if this actually will work or not. How? They can walk to everything from this bus stop. Yes, heating plant. Uh, yes, just about yeah everything they can do. Lovely. Now we need construction offices to bring materials in, uh, but the workforce we can actually now uh, supply locally, which is good. Uh, say this one for example, if you wanted to build this one. I would take these construction offices, then I would Remove the distant workers, but I'll keep the distant uh, concrete and asphalt and the materials from wherever they, they, they are coming. And I'll also add in the local one. They ought to get. And maybe do the same for. Uh, this one. Yeah, we need both, sort of. Uh, has oil shown up here yet? No. What's going on with you then, train? You're moving. Just haven't made it yet. Here you are. No, that's something else. What is this? Steel train. Uh, going in that direction. The okay, yeah, but since I have the little shortcut here, or what you call it, maybe, maybe some trains figure it's a good idea to take this, this route. Could well be that way. Uh, yes, we're going to bring fuel out to, to the train diesel station here. There you go. There we have steel has arrived. Fantastic. Steel is needed by electrical components factories. Right. Yes, we're going to get ourselves do this the old fashioned way and just open hull please. Open hull, open hull, open hull. Uh, Brazilian Scanias, sure. Or actually Swedish Scanias, maybe. I don't uh, read Cyrillic, but I think that that is what it says there. There, you load steel, you load steel, and you go to the that one and unload weight. Get going. You you go to to that one and uh, wait until unloaded. Good. Oops. Close down. Know that I need that one. Now you now have asphalt and gravel on site. Uh, you need concrete too. You have concrete too. You have everything you need to, to start working on the groundworks. Could you send 
workers maybe. Two. You are sending workers from the local place? Think so? This seems rather slow to, to get this road in for some reason. Hmm. <coughs> I closed it down again. Yes, I know it's uh, it's hopeless. They're getting nowhere real fast on this road. Oh, this footpath they uh, seem to be doing something with. And workers, we have workers and where, where do you live? You live locally? Yes, you do. Svenman and People's Palace Flats, fantastic, it's working. Because we're going to need quite a few buses and a bus line more than anything. This is like uh, Sven Mannen's workers. And you have your end station and you go to the workers. You load and you go to to here and you unload now for this we, we're not doing small fast quick buses we're doing uh, like big capacious uh, buses this or this I will do Mercedes. Uh, I don't know if we'll put them into action just now though. Uh, we might be better off not doing doing just that. Uh, <clears throat> this this construction office, if if by any chance someone wants uh, steel around here, you can actually get that close by there and same thing goes for mechanical components not that i think that we will use a whole lot of those but you could theory are you missing bricks boards steel mechanical components okay well it maybe they'll bring it from from around here then They might. Oh, you don't have a covered uh, hull truck. Covered hull. Oh, you'll get one. Or two. I suppose you can't have enough open hulls. Ah, so you're sending these from very far away, I'd imagine. Yes, you are. Yes, but that's bricks. We've yeah, we can do bricks here too. But they're finally arriving, so let's not mess with this right now. And 
this road, you're more than welcome to do it as well. And this, why? why? Ah, right, you don't have a source of asphalt. Uh, we need to, to get the asphalt guys on it. Two. Dum, dum, dum. Bum, 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 bum. Dum, bum, bum, bum. So we do this one a bit differently then. Uh, we take only the local construction office and the remote, uh, the remote asphalt. And we do not do remote workers. I only want the local doing this one. Yeah, there we have stuff. Stuff's coming. There they're working on the road. Very good. And it was confirmed that this is working, that uh, everything is reachable from, from there. And we just need to... Yeah, you're bringing steel in. Very good. You need. We need to bring mechanical components into this place. Uh, and this, this place, yes, the small distribution office here. Uh, you're going to get uh, fuel from here, first and foremost. There you go. And this, this is a bit confusing now, but we we need cover hulls. Cover hull. Yes, and you'll do uh, something rather simple. Uh, you go from from this warehouse, these warehouses, I should say, these warehouses. You load plastics and electrical components in both of them, and you bring those to here unload and try and keep it uh, topped up not that it's going to work but you you can try and as of yet of course not nothing exists because we, we haven't really gotten this going yet but we have oil in the tank there good do we have bitumen here too yes we do do we have bitumen in the heating plant? Yes, we do. Okay, it's, it's August. We need to, to, to put in heat exchangers and things for, for the town. God damn it. Ah. Do not forget about that. No, we cannot. That, that's important stuff. Heat exchanger. But it is too far to, to do without a, uh, a repeater, I think. There to 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 town. Oh, it's 1.3 kilometers. So yes, indeed, that is too far. Uh, but we can do we do something basic for now. We do a heating pumping station. Covered by electricity. Very good. Do you need stuff that they don't have? Yes, you need concrete. Okay, and a heating pipe and a heat exchanger. Heat exchanger we can put down now. Um, remember how much care and attention you did put into everything here. Just throwing down stuff. It can't be helped. This requires concrete too. Yeah, of course it does. It's a it's a construction. There we go. Uh, and a heating heat pipe, heat pipe from from heat making facility here. Take it a bit down and. Uh, 
to there, and another one for good measure. That's not good measure though. That is. This does not require anything that you don't have. Heating pipes get it into to, into the heat exchanger in town too. Some other infrastructure is in the way. Can possibly have dug it a bit a bit deeper, but I didn't. And uh, there it is. Okay, uh, you're 42 minutes into this one now. Uh, and uh, it is extremely late. It is approaching early. Uh, Tomorrow is not a work day though, so but still you can't you can't be doing this. This is unhealthy. It's really not good for you, you know. Uh, I know, but uh, I really want to see how this turns out. Yes, but you're going to have to wait until another day to find out how this turns out. Uh, I suppose so. That should be much of it. Uh, we still do not have a truck for doing... Buy a truck for doing that neither, because uh, it's full here. That's okay, we can get rid of it, of one of those, cover hull, please, and uh, I do have a favorite, it's pretty obvious at this point, I think. Uh, where is it? The warehouse, there it is. There you load mechanical components and you unload those at the electronics assembly hall where you wait until you are unloaded. Very much. It's actually not doing too bad, this. 300 workers on the construction site. Um, obviously they can't keep up with the delivery of... of the... what should we call it? Pipes? Pipes? No, concrete. But the, 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 this should be everything, because you, you now do to the, supply the other stuff that this needs, um, electrical components and plastics, which will be making up up here. This one is uh, not set correctly, we will set it correctly, you only store electronics. There you go. So once we get uh, this finished, uh, we just need to send workers and that should be about it. Mm. Yes, but you have to get off it now. It's just the way it is. Yes, that is the way it is. Thank you so very much for watching. Uh, the 5th of September, the grass is turning brown. The ground is turning brown. People's Proletarian Petroleum Prefecture 220.
five, I believe it was. Thank you so very much for watching. And uh, next time we'll most definitely have this place up and running. Finally. It did take, take a little while to get it all done. But here we are. Very close. Closer than ever. I just can't, can't do any more right now. Good night.